I'm gonna make you follow that hint, hint. That By the way, fun the fact, there's another arsenal back here behind the couple wagon right there, and there's another arsenal behind the trucks over yonder. Pack your own ammo on the half tracks. I'm gonna letting you die. I'm telling you that right. I now. mean, you can pull back and always get more. Like these arsenals aren't going away. Hi. What army are we in? <laughs> are we the bad? Are we? Okay, I need to know. If you want to know if you're the bad guys, follow me real quick. Oh God, the answer's yes. Reno, why did you do this? No one's uh, lying. Look, he said that I wasn't gay enough. Who let the Einsatz stupid in here? Okay, seriously, I need to find the mortar two. Lucky. Oh okay. god damn it, I still haven't. Okay. Lucky, okay. Lucky, okay. Lucky, okay. Help me find the mortar two. Did I save my kit? I did not save my kit. Let's see. Hey. Long range check five zero. Nah, you're totally the good guys. Good check five zero. Uh, okay. You're totally the good guys, guys. The mortar called. I've exactly. not seen okay. Look under launcher, Goober. You gotta get the tripod and the tube. Okay, goddamn it. So, which one of you had goddamn spicy food last night? Shit on the goddamn pile of shit over there. Yeah. Yeah, I call the Jews that. Anyway. What the fuck, Reno, did you do? Reno, uh. It, it's a book burning. It's a book burning. Don't worry about it. Yeah, anyway. Yeah. One saline, but I have plenty of room left. Yeah. Why am I gonna ignore that? You can't go just get just my, uh... you know. Yes, I can. People are the library. I feel like experience. I'm. I feel like I'm in that German I, fucking art film. That's just called. Yeah. The yeah. I'm so glad I'm going to work on it. Save me goddamn metal town. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, German. Yeah. We're just gonna Look, ignore it. Yeah. Don't worry about ghosts. it. Yeah. No other ghosts. Real ghosts. I'm sure we're fine. Team Bene and Quarantines, oh, thank you for joining me on this lovely stream as I quickly do a hydrate. Take the half track just for yeah. Uh, right. Don't worry Dindy. about it. You don't need an ally. Oh, yeah, that's always I did hydrate. Hey, Jimbo, how you doing? Op is simple. They're going to be assisting allied troops and defending against waves of infantry that come in. You know, could you guys, I don't know, do this thing called actually help you to do so instead of fucking around? Are we putting two fifties in there? Ah, y'all are just standing there. I was trying to shoot you. I did. Oh, well, you weren't here for this, but basically, take take the ammo Ooh. from the and put them in the half track. For the guy's doorknob. Oh, here's the arsenal. Brief is in three minutes. That's nice. Spicy. No, oh, no nothing exploded. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. It's pog, it's pog crimes. Name. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I know, Jimbo, you're usually halfway through, but that's A-OK. -okay. This is just meant to be a fun op as we uh, transition to the next campaign, and they have a World War II mod set, so we're just rocking it. I put all the stuff in this. Do that again? the ammo on the other half track you can. All right, everyone gather around. I feel like briefing you early. Come around yonder. Come around yonder. It's time for brief. All right. Everyone open your maps. You're spawning at the HQ position. For reference, this position at GridRef010973. You will be able to respawn back here. If you notice, there's two groups of question marks with arrows. This represents questionable German reinforcements that are coming to reinforce this flank as the Soviets attempt to push through. Now, little cheat sheet right here. These three positions right here represent AA guns. They're gonna be shooting down Soviet planes that fly over. These diamond symbols you see in various different spots represent friendly tanks that are gonna be helping to shoot enemy infantry and armor that cross by. 
And these large lines represent front lines that, uh, well, have entrenched positions of friendly forces. Uh, they're going to be your best bet for allied troops as things come in. Now, if you look on the top right of the map, Soviets are starting to encroach on this position. They are marked as is. They're going to be mainly focusing on pushing this area. So your job is to defend against them. They will have infantry, air, and armored forces, which is why you are mainly infantry with a tank liaison. Uh, if you wanted to break it in the front lines, you have this front line, that front line someone already drew, this front line, and then you're, oh shit, you're going to get spawn camp front line. So, good luck. You have an AA Vic, you have multiple tanks, you got half tracks and transport trucks, feel free to pack them with as much ammo as you can. The enemy will start moving out in exactly 11 minutes, which doesn't mean you have to be up there because you got allied infantry to stop the original pushes, but I want to say by the hour 25 mark, you probably want to be up there. Yeah, well, Otherwise, right. op begins in 11 minutes. Good luck, have fun. Talk to me on Pfizer if you have any questions. Uh, hey, Larry, Go ahead. You mentioned uh, Soviet Air Forces, possibility of Soviet paratroopers. <laughs> Don't ruin the surprise for yourself, Luxie. Uh, other question. I've never used the, like, genuine question. I've never used the statics that you use as tubes. Do we have to pack separate ammo? You have to them? load ammo for it. Yep. Where do we get that from? Also Arsenal. In the same category? No, like, in the same category? Uh, the three magazine category. Thank Feel free to experiment with it. Thank you, Liru. I mean, you got full arsenal, so might as well play around with them, right? All right, kids. You heard them. So, like what? I said before, actually start fucking doing it, or I will... Penalize you hardcore. I'll suck my dick in your air. Actually, what? get off your asses. Start putting your ammo in the ammo trucks and the half track. I don't care if you're still boxes. playing Barbie dress up. You now, in case you don't have artillery range cards, I just put some additional in this box right here if you need stitch kits as a medic or additional bandages because the server overwrite my med overrode my medical settings. Feel free to grab them from there. Why are you Korean? Ah, uh, how dare you assume my race? <laughs> if I was Korean, I would be in that pile over there. Anyway. All right, but yeah, get off your asses. They're putting your ammo in. Woo! Ammo? Okay. It doesn't matter. Feel free to grab multiple types and experiment. What is the name of the order? I already put them in the half track on the left. Yeah, but like we have to get to us one of them. All right, I'll start sending enemy troops in nine minutes. Uh, I think I already set the global settings here, but this is just meant to be a fun little one-off as I transition the campaign. Yep, so that's all ready to go. And then if it turns out that we don't have the heaviest of contact, we then will pull back and take the Panther, because I don't want us to end up... So yeah, original front line here is literally a squad with a Panzer IV and a machine gun turret. Secondary line is a platoon of Panzer IVs with a uh, machine gun turret up here, and then I've got a front line right here. I've got another front line with three pack guns up here in a foxhole. I've got then AA guns back here and a small thing right here. And then you got the player base where they have two transport trucks, two half tracks with both guns, one on the rear, one on the front, one couple wagon, one Panther, one Panzer IV, and one Wumba Waffle. AA's chambered in. I honestly don't know, actually. I mean, that's fine, but... That's fine, but what I'm saying is where you want to take it as its final destination is where we're lucky going, because Luxie has... Oh, yeah, exactly. I'm going to play this, like, Halo firefight, where I'm just going to be sending waves in and then say that there's reinforcements coming in. Just to have fun over the next two hours. Yeah, as for people like Tootie that know all this shit, right? I went out with uh, dinner with Bloodwain. And now we're back ready to play around. I'm just watching my clock. But yeah, this is one of those ops where they uh, basically are assisting allied troops in the field and helping hold things out. Round one, I'm thinking we'll do two squads of infantry per flank. Each flank is uh, one attacking this position, one attacking that position. We'll do a plane overhead, and we'll let things play out as is. But nonetheless, hope you guys are doing okay. I think I'll sober enough. I'll sober off enough in time to uh, 
do uh, what you call it, uh, TMTM, TM, and then I'm just gonna go double down on editing. Otherwise, let's see, random IRL shit. I got a letter from a, a bank saying, hey, we need additional information, your tax returns for this one credit card you want. So I literally just signed up for a different one with the same benefits and they instantly approved me, which I always find to be really funny. Don't take so shit from anyone because you can always find a new company to uh, endorse whatever the fuck you want these days. Never stop that grind. So my Discord, Murdoch, is for my specific ops run on Wednesdays, Saturdays, and Sundays, uh, as well as I put little, well, that's a Patreon perk. For Patreons, I offer early slotting. I put sneak peeks over all of my ops when I feel like it, and then we run private polls on, you know, what to do. If you want Pog's information for when they run stuff and how to join them, just message me on Discord, and I will get you that information because I'm more than happy to uh, pass that information around. Right. You guys can sit wherever you want to sit up. Just cover the front lines to the best of your ability. Just to get my global warming. Uh, warning. <laughs> warming. Excuse me. You did what now? Hey, right on Murdoch. The next one will be tomorrow uh, in between Friday night fights and then after the NA branch. Uh, and then we'll try to do some over the weekend. I'm probably going to do one or two streams a week at this point. Just because I can't find the time anywhere else because I'm so busy. Send in goat team six. Glory Wings, oh, thanks for the five gift subs. If you got to give some Glory Wings, make sure you thank him or her. Nonetheless, I hope you keep enjoying the operations. I do hope you get a nice kick out of this scenario. Send in goat team six now. Yeah. You guys think you're ready? You get loaded up, but make sure you've dotted your T's and crossed your eyes and all that. Send in goat team six now. What's up, Stinky? Yeah. I'm not Stinky, you're Stinky. What do you Jesus need? Christ. Send in goat team six now. Okay, do you want to drive my car? Because I'm going to be on the go. Send in goat team six. Not ahead of time. You want to put some of your Just to harass the front line, something for the uh, quadruple barrel flak 38s to deal with. It'll be nearby. Make sure you guys put the bulwark of your gear into the. Yeah, these things have a fucking abysmal turning rate, unfortunately. Oh, I have a high sensitivity. This really fucking hurts. Literally just dragging my mouse across the screen here. Ground, this is Erica. You boom, ba, Why not? What? What dog, this is Erica. Watchdog to uh, tank, go ahead. Speed rise, we had eyes on what appeared to be Russian Two minutes. reconnaissance aircraft. We have audible on artillery bombardment coming in. Copy, watch the, um, watch the uh, air, try to dodge those planes, like stay under tree cover, keep mobile every so Talk often. Does individually uh, slow track. Do not engage unless they start threatening the front line or if you've got a clear shot. Solid Watchdog to tank. We have a Panzer IV Remember, moving fire out. draws fire, so do not fire on things unless you're ready to start engaging. I'll send something out every 10 minutes. 
How many people can be on that one? Flak 48, usually only one person. It's just the turning raid is atrocious. But yeah, it was a 250 pound bond. I think we're just doing a strafe somewhere. I don't know where this tank went right here. Yeah, but why would we have to do that? We can do it now. I don't know how it magically got its that. fuel back, but that's okay. Putting that back in its for front line. Don't know why it had it fuel its uh, fuel back, but it's weird because I ripped all the fuel off of the tanks and it's like, nope, today I will move around randomly. So let me check these other guys. Yeah, they all have their fuel. That's weird. And this one I already redid, so that's fine. Alright, Red Army, Infantry, we're going to do Scout Squads. Wait until I see 815, and then we'll start sending forces in. No dots. No dots. Covert's in there. Oh. I think Covert's intermediate. Oh. No. Not being difficult. Oh, my shitty spelling. I still got the message across. Standing by. Copy that. Yeah, try not to have a truck to explode again. Standing by. Solid copy. Luckily, who's your battle buddy? Ready for orders. Understood. Okay. Orders. So, we're gonna copy go that. Arctic. I'm right here. Okay, so Arctic, everybody grab my butt. Standing Standing by. All the duty assets. So yeah, this I'm gonna treat as if I'm managing an RTS of some sort. This will be a start. Finally, we got the flak firing off. And there goes the plane. So every five to 10 minutes, I'll be sending another round. Uh, the hydrate, quote unquote, I'm trying to disable that. That's usually when I have an alcoholic drink in play, but I don't right now, and Twitch won't let me disable it because it's not giving me access to my channel points. So uh, just ignore that one for now. But we had that in the uh, previous stream today because I was drinking a double Tokyo tea. We're gonna go to Frontline Bravo. People seem to like it when I'm uh, intoxicated. So. Get there at your own pace. You got this front line going right here. Wow, that entire flank is dead. In three minutes, I will send another wave. One casualty has happened right here. Everyone's died off of that one, too. Next one is literally going to be another two scout squads, uh, and then we will bump it up with another vehicle. Otherwise, hope you're all a okay. I know Twitch does want me. I already went out and uh, you know had a few more to drink, so I am a little shit faced right now. But let's see how these guys go. Watchdog to Panzer. Another three minutes. Send for Erica. I'm going to. Erica, stick to my time be advised, points. we're going to be heading to uh, backline Charlie, surveying frontline Bravo, and then we're going to set up at frontline Bravo and cover frontline Alpha from that area. Telecopy, do be advised, we are positioned in between Backline Charlie and Frontline Bravo. I do have visual on Frontline Alpha taking Two contact. Minutes. Copy, all units on net, permission to engage granted, all units weapon free, open fire. Drunk earlier is finally, yeah, some people say so. Ich werde beschossen! Woo! Woo! Here's one tall 
fire, that's cute. Still about a minute, a little over a minute before I call in the next wave, because I'm going to be doing it every five to ten minutes, as I said. Also, holding in sneezes sucks. Every five minutes, that's when I'm going to spawn a new wave. Second wave is there's just going to be re infantry reinforcements, something major. Go ahead. I'm going to leave the truck in the valley so it does not get shot. Over. The fuck are they on? Wave two. Chuckleheads. Wave three, I'll do two scout squads and uh, additional team of some sort. Probably AT. Yeah, so I'm gonna group these guys up individually so I don't have the guns turned in opposing areas. is when I'll start adding stuff, so that's not till another, you know, 15, 20 minutes. Well, it gives the player base some time to dig reinforcements. I'm doing all right, Don. But yeah, every five waves, I'll give them some personal reinforcements, so probably a German squad to come in or whatever I feel like, because we're just going to make this last till uh, about 9.45. Second KIA just came in. Because this is just the AI mod playing out, and the map is uh, one of the Ukraine maps. His squad, though, I mean, still a perfect score, and they've killed quite a few Soviets, so... Not bad on that front, not bad on that front at all. Round three, I'll probably have uh, a T-34 just come down the middle. Yeah, the flanks are holding quite well, admittedly. It's given plenty of time for the player base to build themselves up on this front line right here. And these guys digging their additional lines as they can see the fire coming in. They're digging vehicle trenches as well. Ah, for their half-track with the MG. Not a bad call there. Not a bad call there at all. They just need to make sure they're digging themselves some defensive lines. Otherwise, they will get picked off regardless of, you know, the scopes they put on their uh, bolt-action car 98s and whatnot. Three minutes till the next wave. Yeah, they're trying to dig a defensive line with their uh, tanks right uh, here because there's a platoon of tanks right here, and then they got the front line forces Since right here as well. Be advised, I'm going to mark on the map in green where our specific force is set up at. We're still at front line, Bravo. Otherwise, Otherwise they only have their uh, Panzer IV fielded. Go ahead and delete that stuff because I don't need that actively stand. going. So they still have their Panther, their um, Flak Panzer, if I remember correctly. Yep and a uh, half-track in reserve. They brought both ammo trucks up and the uh, MG cover wagon. Watchdog, any units 
on that be advised we're going to be holding the main infantry at hold line greenleaf tank you are to stay right, behind front line bravo and potentially back line charlie and just run the skirmish you see any armor that's your priority copy that that'll let me uh communicate with them Another two minutes. Literally, this is just firefight from Halo 3 in an armor op, you know? Oh my god. You, 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 you. Yes, I've dug myself some foxholes and whatnot. Broadshore's already trying to pick off a few Russians that he sees from all the way back here. A decent start. One more minute till reinforcements. Ooh, right, they have a few uh, from the CSA 38 mod. Ready for orders. Which means I can bury my armor as well, so I'll send that in. way for reinforcements and we're including one little tank. Someone just got picked off. But again, the focus is the infantry back here and they are actually taking hits. That I'm assuming is this tank right here. Player base will have some more action supporting the uh, infantry lines from all the way back here. Next round, I'll do two teams and two squads of scouts before I promote them to regular rifle squads, and we'll do AT teams for the rest of the game. Yeah, Fardoni, there is the risk of them overpressuring themselves if you see how their trench line is compared to the gun. So, yeah, they will take a bit of overpressure damage, but. I mean, coulda, woulda, shoulda, you know? Trench line definitely took some damage here from that tank round coming in. But now you're gonna see this uh, armor platoon fire on this tank as they uh, come in. So now you're hearing it cook off. And that's everyone down, essentially. So again, I start things slow. I treat it like a, you know, standard game. Gives the player base a bit of time to set up their defensive lines and, you know, I'll slowly encroach infantry in. But yeah, infantry for the most part is getting wiped on the uh, far west flank. The east flank is the concerning one. Watchdog 2, high command. This is high send message. Be advised. The uh, AI view distance is going to be set to because I'm telling my guys, uh, you know, don't shoot unless shot upon, fire draws fire. But is the AI just going to instantly know where we are to a certain extent, or how does that going to work for the top? Well, your tank somehow managed to kill itself on a trench, but uh, I'll go ahead and refund that tank because I'm nice. Well, that was pretty entertaining to watch. Uh, AI view distance is going to vary because World War II, it's a little difficult to uh, predict what's going on. Um, it is on 90% by default, which usually means they can see to you up to a kilometer away if you are in the open. Uh, tanks can see you a little bit farther, but um, treat the AI at the same render distance that you can see them at. How copy? Ground copies. We'll play that into consideration. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I don't know how they just blew themselves up right there, but that was cute. Player base! 
Yeah, be advised and ask a question. Yeah, that just happens with Arma. With the player bases, this is something I gotta fucking learn to deal with. Ah, oh, that's funny. Alright, another two minutes. Let's see. The 76 down. Good ghost. Yeah. I think we got five. Copy that. They did. That's why I refunded your tank. Thank Stay you. Five. You're a god. The way. I mean, he is god, yes. That is how it works. The folks are still out there. round going in. I did say I'd send a second team of dudes as well, so let's throw in three map teams in each. Yeah, I think it's a tank's machine gun that's cutting them down. So yeah, they're up on the front line making their uh, first major line here. They're going to act as the infantry for the Sank Platoon as these uh, front platoons start taking damage. I'm going to go ahead and delete front line bodies here. Otherwise, the real issue is going to be when the tank runs out of ammo. Some squads outright falling back, which is quite funny. Tell me soon the Soviets had probably uh, because those, uh, those some howitzer tanks I could send up at them. They have a mortar set spot. up, that's nice. Yeah, well, we'll, maybe we'll keep an eye on that. Quick before I forget Ready. him. I'll use one of him every five rounds. Three minutes before I send the next wave, and I'm deleting anything that's falling back essentially. Doing a great job of these mortars though, putting them ahead. Keeping them all nice and steady. Yeah, you hear some heavy things going off back here. Oh, that's the mortar. Yeah, I wasn't stopping them from uh, constantly bringing more AG shells up to the fray. Like they are advancing on the right at the left. 
Start with the armor going in, and I'll send the infantry in a second because it takes the armor a hot second to send in. So he never drove in. I'll remote control him in a second if he still proves uh, annoying. Otherwise, we got the infantry squad right here. to defend only, that's cute. T-34 starting to move in. I don't know what it's firing at in terms of infantry, but yeah, you got the pack guns immediately plinking at it. And it's already flamed out. Come on, Mr. Sure Lendley, get, get up there. Down our way. So yeah, most Copy. of this left flank is starting to fall apart. Right flank's still pretty good. I guess west and east. Yeah, these guys are about to come around and do some serious damage. Oh, nope, they just took a hit. minutes. There goes that cooking off. And the other Vex are still coming in. Go ahead. Yeah, it's like starting to collapse. Disregard that. So now the infantry will start bypassing and heading up to... Start pulling back as a broken line. On the way. This line's still pretty solid, but that line I'm trying to have uh, officially pulled back. This is Watchdog to High Command. Message over. This is High Send Message. Be advised, one of our frontline spotters just saw 
Russians board one of our own vehicles. Model unknown at this time. How copy? So that was the front line because it was pretty much wiped. They're boarding a friendly tank and trying to pull back to another front line. That wasn't Russians doing it. That's just the Germans pulling back from the front line. How copy? Copy, good. I'll see what my spotter saw and we'll go from there, but thank you. Roger, out. Okay. Operation's go going good. First, uh, you know, 40 minutes in, we started the op in about 25 minutes ago. Copy. I've got the Alright, final wave here. I got a force that's completely pulled back. Oh boy. Ah yes, the Russians as a rocket artillery army. Classic. Hey, uh, Patches, the heavy key, send me up. I'm having a rescort uh, coming up here with me. The key, send me another person to the north just so we get that side covered too, so we don't completely neglect it to build. Round five. On the way. So again, every five rounds, they'll send an artillery strike. Patches, I understand. Heading north. Ha! Now we're gonna start getting into standard infantry teams. Back up, fighters, fighters. Start pushing pressure on their front line. You got tank shells firing through. Let's see if they uh, fortified themselves enough. Round six will begin in four minutes. Lines have been broken more or less. Now we're just putting pressure on the frontier. Oh, pack gun just got smashed. It's up to AA to cover based off of you know what's flying in the air here. Oh yeah, and it's round five, so I will spawn a reinforcement squad to come in. Let's do Vermont infantry. Watchdog to Erica, update on your position and current situation. Be advised, we are in one of our one of the two of our firing positions. Uh, currently engaging what looks like enemy stragglers at the south end of the line. Copy. 
drop, be, be advised. Um, we, uh, we're moving up AA to try to counteract the air. If you start taking shots, move out. Uh, be careful. Remember, fire draws fire, and if you start taking out too many things, they might sick the air on you. Yeah, we're, we're keeping an eye on this guy as well. All forces of the German right command be advised. Friendly infantry squad has arrived and is moving up to the current front line at this time. Over. Watchdog copies all. Hey, I was wondering where you're going. What? Yeah, I'm being seized by tank. On the way! Patches! Watchdog copies. Eric, are you able to uh, assist? We've got friendly infantry moving in from the. West, and we've got a tank attack from Solid copy, we've got eyes on it, we're gonna try and engage it with what we've got. Get that guy back in the air. Before pushing up, it got immediately annihilated. Woo! On the way. Oh, that tank's taking some uh, hits there. Pressure on there. Let's see. What do we have in terms of extra vehicles to send in? That would be Red Army. Let's do another T-34. Ah, no, I'll do a BT-7A. Fuck it. Welcome. Roger. So three teams are falling back. That's fine. Ooh, tanks doing a lot of damage to that infantry coming up. Next reinforcement wave in five minutes. Watchdog to Erica. Thanks, all doing a good chunk of damage. Joy Profit, for thanks for the 23 month resub, my man. Alpha. I hope you keep watching uh, everything. I hope you're enjoying playing everything because I know you like to play as well. And I hope you get a nice kick out of this scenario. If you can disengage, do so, but if not, go ahead and keep on it. Uh, don't get pinned by the infantry. No, we we back out and move unable. Do you need us to move somewhere? That's a negative. I just want you to knock their armor out since there's being a little bit of a problem right now. Copy that. Send and Murdoch, thanks for the six months in advance, my man. I really do appreciate it. I hope you keep enjoying the operations. And anyway, I hope you get a nice kick out of the scenario. Prisco born, uh, Russian tankettes. I'm not, there's a few individual mods that have a few, but in terms of this mod, I'm not sure if I have them. Uh, cause you gotta get into a lot of the, the specialized mods for that stuff, unfortunately. I think I just have the BT-7, unfortunately, but that I don't think even is a tank yet. That's more of just an anti-infantry vehicle. So now that he's up to the front line, I'll let him start engaging. This guy is on the driver's seat, and I still got one guy on the gun, so I'll start moving him up. Reinforcements in three minutes. I think we have base IFA-3 and they might have CSA-38 because I've noticed a few things from CSA-38, but we don't have like the BT-7 modern northern fronts. We might have northern fronts actually because I've seen some of the terrains, but the terrains are separate from the actual northern fronts mod that has the weaponry. Stuff to say. I cannot tell. But uh, POG is one of the communities I simply Zeus for. It's not where I control the mod set. Do we have the in the air? 
This is Lira. We do not have any Luftwaffe assets in the air at this time. Over. Copy. All birds are killed. All birds are killed, he says. I need two patches. Go ahead, Jan. They shot my radio. They shot my radio. Copy. The birds are going to be coming in from the north. I've cooked off the tanks. Yeah, so we got the flat guns also firing. Alright, it's about time I send another wave of <clears throat> reinforcements. This is wave 8. Fuck it. Para Matildas from Lend Lease, because why the fuck not, you know? This is Watchdog to right here, Liru. What is the ROE on downed enemy combatants, such as Violet? Ah, uh, take no prisoners, comrade. That's what the Russians would say, so we might as well follow the same order. We are not Soviets. Copy. I know, we're fighting the Soviets, but that's what they would say. Okay, uh, I have a question. Am I just running there or something? Yep, run to the front line. Any direction, any idea which way it is? Ah, uh, follow the gunfire, dude! Where was that one? Yeah. Ah, they can figure it out. You say that, but they might shoot me. You know, it's gonna make good content for me, so I really don't care. Watchdog to right crew to be advised. I think the Russians have some sort of trickery. This man's flailing around like a ragdoll. Pain. Do not worry, Commander Liru. Our glorious AA has killed the Russian unarmed threat. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, that's funny. So that's the guy talking on the radio. They're gonna try to go hunt down the unarmed pilots, which is pretty damn funny if I do say so myself. Excuse me, the south, not the west. My bad. All right, I'm gonna spend the next wave here driving these guys on. I, I'll try to play TMTM, but I'm not guaranteeing it at the moment. back there, but he is. We got three minutes before the next wave, so that's fine. So I'm just fine. I'm driving these tanks up because the AI are being special. Go ahead. 
Their accents are killing me. IFA tanks say I really are God's drunkest driver, yeah. Yeah, let's go with that. Send in go team six. Willow, thanks for the two gift subs. If you got a sub from Stone Willow Tree, make sure you thank him. Otherwise, I hope you all keep enjoying the operations. And I do hope you get a nice kick out of this scenario. Alright, round, I think, nine at this point. The bus is here to pick a pattern. Over. Guns have been hit. That's that's no bueno. is right command say again over right command i'll ping my position with the power of our advanced intelligence capabilities but uh, some of the ai support is stuck in the sky because the flank in the background uh i'm i'm literally just a dude in a chair like in the back line if someone doesn't want to respond to me i can't control them so you know it's it's like reno when he gets scared of the ao you know Yeah. I got a question. Yeah. Rates that I have to manually fill up with stuff, and because with the mortar we can get the ammo's near it, it fills up. But uh, having to constantly like fill up a backpack, okay, it's just uh, it's really here. Got nuts. I mean, I want to use a World War Two one, but all right. I mean, I could, but not all of them are properly ace compatible so you wouldn't be able to carry them around or load them in the VIX so it's better just go to vanilla no problem that is true not all of the crates are ace compatible which is why I'm really wary about giving them so I'll just default to vanilla sometimes All right, round 10 is gonna begin in three minutes. So I'm gonna set up the line here. Katusha rockets have been, you know, going out. We're gonna rearm that puppy. Uh, hopefully it'll actually have rockets, you know, there we go. I mean, I could have pre-made some, but I didn't think that they'd actually want some, so, you know. Okay, long green. Well, stuck with what, uh, okay. uh have to place in Zeus, you know? Yeah, 
out for there. Come on up to the front. The cat left you now, your chest is called. Nice. In a bad way, but I get you. Totally compromised. Now it's going to be pure AT squads. Because those can actually do damage to the entrenched armor. Round 10. Bestie Pound, like thanks for the third nine month uh, resub. Sorry if I butchered that, but nonetheless, hope you keep enjoying the operations and having a nice kick out of the scenario. We've been watching yourself this entire time. Uh, well, you're not watching well enough because I'm looking at a tank that's tickling my tits right now, Ghost. Pick it up, get over here. Jesus. Oh, yeah, we're, we're engaging infantry because we're the only element to the south. Uh, Ghost, there's an AA vehicle currently killing my infantry. Please come over here. I don't see where that AA vehicle yeah, is. Yeah, at least the infantry, friendly infantry what groups I'm, up what here. What I'm looking at is a Matilda within danger close distance. Why well, I don't care what the qualification specification is, I need it dead. Yeah, it's down. Now that was, I think, the first artillery shell that came in. Another one. Ooh, something big just hit over here and knocked the dude out. damage to their uh, front line. Uh-oh. Ah, the couple wagons cooking off. When I finish with this, I will send two friendly infantry squads up. If you hear me, could you hear me? You have an entrenching pull. Redig those trenches once you're done with the FBA unit. Copy. Forces, all forces. This is Rag. Be advised, two infantry squads are moving up to the front line from our spawn point. They are going to help continue to keep the front line in order as the Soviet dog sends their men against us. Good luck out. Two minutes.
Oop, Luxie died. That's no bueno. So yeah, next round we'll probably do T T thirty fours and then uh, two infantry groups as well. So. Yeah, if you have a need tool, you can repair the trenches as they take damage. The trenches taking damage is like one of the newest features, though, admittedly. I think round 15, I'll have some sort of like crazy air battle go on as the infantry battle wages. All right, about 9.05, let's do another wave of reinforcements here. This is round 11. Ready for orders. Ready for orders. We'll do two Shermans. Ready. Oh, it's supposed to be AT teams, but my bad. Really? Because I don't remember trench damage being a more modern thing of more than, you know, a few years old, but I could be wrong. I mean, I remember it at least as old, a uh, little past uh, Brad trenches being changed to group Adler trenches, the French name, in terms of the modding community, but that's at least a few years old, so I could be getting thrown off, you know? North or East. Sometimes, hey, I just genuinely don't remember properly. Refueling the artillery to use at round 15. Understood. The way. Player base doing their best to hold the front line. German forces moving in Albet slowly. This is Raj Command. So, oh, sorry, <clears throat> Iraq Command. Send message over. Hello, be advised. Your friends are stuck. We're at north. Penetrate in front rack. Going around. Please do something. Thank you. Uh, Roger, well, the enemy are franking our northern front line and it's taking heavy damage, so you might have to pull back soon and risk risking in Sugarman. Over. Roger. Fucking racist. Yeah, just here. Yeah, that plane just got uh, shot down. Yeah, it's a hero uh, going. Go damn Mongolian! It's always tearing uh, down my ride! Uh, I've requisitioned the whirlwind considering nobody was using it because the Russians are flying around like uh, damn why? Is your tank still good? Because you guys might have to pull a rear guard here in a second. Because my tank is fine. You can probably pack it up. Or... Come on, all conditions optimal. Hey, Commandant. I am. All right. Uh, hey, you can pump. Run, run, run. He might be racist. Infantry is moving back. Yes. I'm sorry if I offended you, Yasuhiro. You see, I am a content creator, doing my best to create content. Where are those paratroopers? Oh! That makes down. Mark them then. Patty, start grabbing people. Half track and people are gone. Uh, start getting everybody back towards that truck to the body that's like the end. So 
I'm refilling their ammunition, but even then, it's taking a hot second. I don't see you doing a flash of a breath. Mortal windows officially out of ammo. Y'all say hero, man. Yeah, Why you gotta be that, speaking man. like that, dog? Good. You see, I'm doing my best here to make impressions of everyone equally, man. Yeah. You know how it is. Yeah. I shouldn't be intoxicated while I stream, but here we are. Yeah. That's my best shot. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's all I got. All right, so Pod Force is pulling off of the front line here because they're taking a lot of casualties. We got a few tanks going around here, but you know we're doing our best. You're right. I forgot. Well, I mean, it's your fault for also not mentioning the Kool Aid, and we got the fancy hydrate here. Speaking of 909, round 12 reinforcements. Where be that am on driving it back? Fun tank. God damn it. Ready for orders. This is uh, Watchdog 2, uh, right command. Can you please teleport player CB into truck as she AFK? around 12 as the northern flank has collapsed we're going to keep an eye on the middle and see if we need to move back up or not i will admit i have lost count i love how i still have this tank up here i'm gonna just give them a quick rearm for them to help hold the line but otherwise watch it with the infantry south of the out of the hill heading to the southernmost of the ai tank position standing by responding the infantry to help send them up got this lone infantry right here i don't know why they're disappearing from my interface and reappearing that's a little weird Watchdog, Erica, do you want to set Charlie or do you want to set Delta? We're going to pull up behind Charlie. Stand by. This is Watchdog to Erica, Attack AA, and Tank B5. We're pulling up at the AA position right behind Bravo. Stand by. We're going to keep this position tenable, and if it's not, we're going to continue to withdraw. Copy that. Trying to push that IS-2 into position. Artillery, excuse uh, me, triple A positions here. Watchdog to Erica. Send for Erica. Be advised, we're going to hold up at hold point box and see if this position is tenable. If this position is not tenable, we're going to go to back line Delta. How copy? Solid copy. We're trying to find a uh, position behind your, to, to the west of your position somewhere that's tenable for us to sit and defend. So I'm keeping an eye on the front line here. I'm deleting everything that's further back than it should be. This is Watchdog to uh, right command. 
This is the Reich send message over. Be advised, is the front, is the northern flank completely broken or are we, what's going on? I am unable to establish communication, so it is unknown at this point. Over. Copy. Yeah, they're down to like two dudes. Another uh, little bit of time. This is wave what, 13 or 14? I've honestly forgotten. That's fine. Ready for orders. Awaiting orders. We're doing three squads per push. Target in sight. Send in go team six. Yeah. Yeah, that's gotten blown up. Hero, thanks for the 23 month reset, my man. Sorry if uh, I was offending you earlier, but nonetheless, I hope you keep enjoying the operations. I do hope you get a nice kick out of this little scenario here. It's just a matter of wave defense. Machine gunner's got his head taken off. Verdammt! Werf doch euer Leben nicht weg! This is uh, Watchdog. You have hold your thing for a minute. Go. Be advised, Patty. I'm sending Hatter with you because he's having some sort of kid thing. I don't know. Let him get in your key or let him get in your AZ and keep going back. Oh, I hit two. Gonna have to be good enough. Oh, he's shooting at infantry spot that's come way around there. Now the steward's firing at him. Thank you, Erica. We've got a Matilda that's just breached behind our line and is cutting us off between Delta and Holtzman Fox. Can you take care of it? I have an idea. It's a bold strategy, but it's going to have to work. Up your... Oh, he got me. Damn it. Well, they're flaming out, though. in here what I want to send in terms of the pair mocked. Why? 
Uh, we don't have a rearm Vic here at this time, apparently. Oh. Hi, guys. Oh. All forces, this is the right. Be advised, the Luftwaffe is here to clear the skies. Over. Watch that, copies. The Luftwaffe is here. Ready for orders. Waiting. Ready. Awaiting orders. Yeah, got you. Go ahead, Hattie. That time will be. I bring it past. Copy. I love the special rounds. Hattie to Hattie and you, I told Ghost, I'm sorry for the uh, little, uh, for my AT flying over the tank and blowing him to smithereens. Ooh. Hey, you still around? I'm right here. Yeah. I'm rearming the uh your flak panzer once because you're gonna need it. Oh no. Good luck. Thank you. The sky battle at this point, boys, and Luffle Off is heavily out, gunned and outnumbered. Be advised, we've just engaged an infantry contact inside the base. Copy. 
and if we get encircled, we get encircled. Be advised, uh, we'll deal with that escalator. This is Watchdog 2 High Command. We get uh, the, the sergeant, ranking sergeant of the AA crew to tell them to get the fuck off so we can use them because apparently he's in case and licking the floor and not shooting down the Russian aircraft. Have you ever tried turning those guns? It's it's very difficult, but you're free. Feel free to try. I have just recruit them all that are still active over. Copy. Brilliant. Welcome to hell, boys! It's just airstrikes going on, which is going to cause framiness overall. Woo, baby. Definitely a messy one. It's because I have so much stuff down, I don't want to deploy everything just yet. But Son of Shadow, thanks for a 54 month resub, my man. I hope you keep enjoying the operations. I do hope you get a nice kick out of this scenario. Chased out for the most part. Round's gonna start a little late, but let's get the reinforcements in. We're on what, wave 16? More or less. I think that plane got shot down last second because I don't see it anymore. Hey, hey, it seems like we're getting counter All forces, this is right. Be advised, air support has driven the forces away, but in doing so, they have pulled away to keep the forces pulled back. Good luck in your defense. Over. But the STG-44 medical was break their immersion. Yeah, I gave them arsenal, so they're allowed to take what they want. You know, not much I can do about that, unfortunately.
Yeah, they're getting pretty nastily encircled here. So they're doing their best to use the AA defense, but it's just not enough. This is pretty much the last man, yeah. Nonetheless, hey, yeah. Thank you so much for a four three month resub. I hope you enjoying the operations. I do hope you get a nice kick out of this scenario. Yeah, just snipe that AA gun. the tank that's good all right 9 30 next way over reinforcements because i'm doing out five minute increments i just missed the uh Ready. last few groups there watch dog erica Thanks. Luxy away. Oh, God. It's annihilating everybody. It's going to force them to make another front line in three minutes when the next wave comes in. Jesus, titty fucking Christ. Three minutes. See, on the bright side, in two waves, they get some uh, infantry reinforcements to come help them out at this point. Sorry for not Ready. listening to your band. You know, they got that going for him, yeah, but... Woo! So this guy's pulling back. I'm going to pull him back up there before I delete him. That way he won't be capturable by the player base.
I still have another minute. Have years on. They've been doing their best yep. to hold. Start to start telling people to fall back to backline Delta. We're gonna start digging in. I don't know. Hang on. Yeah, bring them back here. Yes. Not even fucking close. Technically, that was my tank spawn point, too, so this is about to get messy. Russians exceed in literally just throwing bodies at their problems, so that's gonna be the reinforcements for that. And then we'll have one more round, that'll be round 20. In which case it will be a massive artillery bombardment at the minute just beforehand. They've been doing a good job so far. We got Hattie over here covering. Meanwhile, they're doing another defensive line. So, yeah, some of the AI that never moved up are finally getting uh, some action here. of crux at this point. So I'm just gonna have to spawn platoon levels at him. Gotta remember that they don't have any form of triple R, so whatever they get, they get. So I'm gonna send in the reinforcements now, so I don't have to worry about things later.
Watchdog to Patty. Copy that. Copy that. Come in. Mr. Hadim, the Dream Johnson, could you Copy. please tell the infantry get them organized and digging in? I'm coming back with Biddle now. Ready for orders. Solid. Watchdog to tank tech underscore. Go ahead and start pulling back yourself if you're able to, or you can stay with the tank and help. Up to you. This is right command to all standing forces in the field. Be advised, we've been reinforced by a platoon of infantry for squads, a weapon baffle tank, the AA version, and two Panzer fours. That is going to have to be it. We are not expecting any reinforcements till tomorrow at that point. Good luck. Watchdog copies, digging in. Watchdog, this is Erica. Go ahead. Be advised. Currently, I have myself, a Panther, and a Panzer IV holding at Round Old Line Berlin. I remember I, also, I, I know where the, the five part of the round is. Let me get everybody situated. Uh, to add additional, there is a second uh, Panzer IV. How many Panzer IVs do you guys have? Uh, to uh, three edition, we have three Panzer IVs, one Panther, and one IS-2. Copy. Um, U-3, grab, underscore, because I saw they were in a tank. Go back to base, reorganize yourselves into an efficient tank thing. We're going to let the uh, forward vanguard deal with whatever else is up there. Copy. We included uh, underscore in that count. Copy. Get back to base. Decide what people you want to bring up, because this is going to be the last hurrah. Uh, underscore, are you on this LR? Did you guys Fire. really put underscore in a tank by himself? I did not to be fair, nobody nobody informed us that we had another Panzer IV on... I didn't either. I thought you guys told underscore to get in it. I think he just kind of did that. So I'll try to get that whole <sighs> Solid copy. We're, me and me and Pants 4 are going to hold at baseline for a lane and keep cover. It's a selection bug where it keeps selecting the original unit instead. Um, again, I can tell you to not do that. You don't have to base figure that shit out. Ow. Panther is moving back. I see underscore moving back. Oh god. Uh, I have <laughs> two and other Panther. Your artillery back. just hit me. I recommend that you also move back. That should be ghost and covered. Yeah, I'm be advised. I was dealing with a large group of the You're in your side. I'm clear the net! Be advised, a missile just actually, I think it's a Russian artillery rocket just hit the HQ. Be advised, no matter where you are at this point, you are under threat of Soviet dog air and artillery pressure. Be careful, over. We'll hold the line to the last right command. Uh, right command, I can uh, inform you that our current base has a crashed Russian bomber, uh, so uh, can on the uh, nowhere to sink. Shit happens, young Reno. Defend the line. This is Patrick Reno, why? I did not shoot the Russian. No, why are you on the radio? Because I am in command of my own tank. I mean, again, they're doing a great job. You can see all these bodies working up here. Three more minutes till I do the next wave. I'm gonna be honest, at this rate, we're not gonna have enough room to do uh, TMTM tonight, because they're surviving. You know? This is Watchdog Erica. Reorganize the tanks as quick as you can. We're gonna have the m 3 tree meld out most of those other armor assets coming up. Copy uh, that. Could offer them a way out? You know, I could. Eventually, they'll have to pull back. We'll cross that bridge when we get there.
heavy rocket artillery. I swear to God, that wasn't me. Oh my God. War is hell, Scoob. War is hell. Like Zoinks. here. Cause yeah, it's getting messy. Several anti-tank launchers. I've also got a squad of infantry over here on the left. Bomber wing reporting. I got town. Russian bomber coming in. Oh, Jesus. Russian bomber eliminated his tanker's trench. Oh, well, yeah, it was nice while it lasted. Yeah, do be advised, it's like fucking six infantry men ahead of the tank line that are down. This is Watchdog calling units on that. Please stop using the LR like an SR. I'm pointing out the obvious, we can all see that. We're all up there with you. This is the Black Panther up front. We are flat. Panzer four is out of HE. Watchdog copies. Now it's just full fucking send at this point. 
The Soviets never Panther, run out of forces. Right crew uh, player crew tank. Oh, hamburgers. This is Reich Command. Be advised, the Soviets are breaking through on your northern and southern flanks. They might risk encircling you. You might have to pull back. It will disappoint the Fuhrer, but at least it will save your lives. Over. And my shitty accent. Watchdog copy, though. The Soviet dogs are relentless. We have been inflicting a casualty ratio of 10 to 1, and yet they still. Oh god, a rocket just struck my building! The dogs have hit my tower! Damn them! Damn the Soviet dogs! All units on that, fall back to. Fall back, or back, flying Delta. Fall back, take up the trenches. Go, get in the tank. If you have an LR and you're near someone, help them to fall back, or we're leaving them behind. There is not going to be a debate. This is Panzer 4 underscore. Uh, I'll try to go to the front, pick up as many people as I can. Uh, no, so that was, um, that was AT coming in from the AT squad at that angle. But it did look like a rocket actually hit the, uh, Flak, uh, Flak Panther. He literally got blown up right there. Holy shit. Fall back. Didn't mean to sit there like a sandwich. Tanks, reposition yourselves. We are at spawn. What are, are we supposed to be falling back further? No. You know, I see all three of you looking at each other like you're about to start fucking. Get your guns pointed the right direction. Patches, the tank crew is not in charge of the second Panzer IV that's got damage on it. I, I was talking about all of you. Collectively, you're all staring at each other. Get your tank the right way. We're in there, coming from the north, or south, and east patches. We need a tank looking in every direction. And the sight lines are slim. I'm not arguing about it, because my first all three of you staring at each other. Now get your tank north, or I'll do it myself. The Soviet dogs are endless! Someone tell the infantry crew Panzer IV to get on LR-50 so they can actually be told where their targets are. They have enemies to their left, that's behind the wood wall. This is where it gets messy. Admit it. Standing by. Ready. Solid copy. Standing by. Standing by. On the way.
their official kill count is that number right there, but I know there's been more. Rex North is a good tree squad. I got a random, uh, I ran out of bolts with a machine gun. Copy. Uh, are you, uh, never mind, stand by. Underscore, keep your perimeter up there. We'll have the other tank deal with the other side. Covert, uh, pull back slight south, uh, slight, uh, the, your south is, uh, heavy contact. Are we going to have no contact coming in? No zero seven zero. Oh boy. I already cleared them to pull out of the AO and they decided not to, so. Oh boy. Here, that one's cooking off. Don't worry about my burning body, he says. before I get annihilated. Oh god, one of the boxes is spinning endlessly. Like I said, this is pretty much the wrap up at this point. Uh, secret weapon just refers to positional planes, which I don't really have any of, uh, so to speak. Conscript spam, yeah, literally. Just the glorious finale at this point. minute baby every 
five minutes. Unfortunately, they are endless. Just to wrap it up, I'm sorry, Broadjaw, no, it's middle, all right. That's just for immersion's sake. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so before anyone bitches, I just want to say the mission's a fail because that's just for the sake of lore, accuracy, and bullshit. Uh, that was an unwinnable mission. Uh, Dr. Fush, you are hot mic and everything I say. Please oh, sorry. Yourself. That's all good. Uh, but this was just meant uh, to be a fun little one-off uh, as I gather your information for the next part of the, um, what was it, PMC campaign. So um, it just, you know, now that I have the information, I can tell Patch which uh, map to add to the mod set, blah, blah, blah. Uh, but regardless, hope you had fun uh, in that unwinnable quote-unquote scenario. Um, definitely went longer than I thought you would. Uh, I'm enough to miss TMTM because of it, but I'm perfectly happy, um, to, you know, keep this bleeding over, uh, to the point I literally have to throw the book at you and break the squads into individual units and just have them charge you mindlessly as conscripts. Um, there were about a hundred and, I want to say, twenty German AI down, and, uh, you killed at least 450 enemy AI, so your numbers were favorable, but Soviet conscript spam always gets the best of you. Especially with um, the out production of T-34s and everything charging it on you. So, hope you had fun. If you didn't, feel free to batch me. You know the rules. If you liked it, send me something. If you didn't, feel free to put things down on feedback. But this was just meant to be a fun little one-off and playing with German gear, whatever you wanted from the arsenal, essentially. So, um, hope you enjoyed it. And if you didn't, feel free to uh, bitch at me. Otherwise, I'll turn it over to Patch. Hello, friends. So, um... We'll talk about this more in depth later, but um, I'm going to put out the buy list um, if there's any final tweaks you guys want to make. But we did test it last week, and people were mostly happy. There are two things I got to change on that before I present it to Liru, but we will he who, um, if you saw that little like market thing we made, like three out of those four channels are just discussion. I'm going to yep. throw what we're actually buying in the thing that says Liru Emporium, so it keeps okay. it nice and clean for you. So... In terms of the actual op, um, this was just supposed to be a one-off fun op, but in my opinion, guys, a little self-discipline could have had us going a lot longer. Like, just everybody grabbed right. whatever they want from the arsenal, and everybody wanted to do what other uh, kind of weird-ass German soldier they wanted to be. Like, Lexi was from the Africa Corps, and that's fine, but 
there was a lot of machine gun medics, and so it was very <laughs> hard to figure medics. out who's who. So I would say next time, I told you the guys, this guy's a million times, fill out the first squad because everybody picked a random squad and everybody picked a random MOS because no one wants to be stuck as the rifleman. I get that. But probably could have done a little bit better at that, even if it was meant for us to fail, if we had just bit the bullet and had people stick to particular roles instead of 10,000, you know, ATMG medics. Um, I know communication kind of sucked, but it, like, then again, I didn't really have that great of a communication network. I had Hattie and that was it. I didn't have anybody who wanted to fold into normal roles. So I really didn't try that hard with tactics this time around because I knew as soon as everybody looked like a fucking clown right circus, up, like right it's that fun. one video yeah, you know, with the Christmas tree GI and the Nazi uh, robot and all that. Like Some of you know what I'm on about. I knew as soon as you guys looked like a circus, trying any sort of hard and in-depth tactics and treating this seriously would have been a bad call. So I just kind of let you do whatever. But in the future, if you guys want to actually try and succeed, quote unquote, or actually try at the mission, there has to be self-discipline across the board. You got to all fold into one squad, you got to stick to an, uh, an MOS, and you got to get out of the mentality of no one else can do a Swiss Army kit, but I can because I'm me. Because if you guys want more discipline in ops, which I don't, if you don't, that's fine. But if you guys want ops to not be like this or not be a little bit more silly, it starts with yourself. If other players see that 90% of the room is not acting like a fucking clown, they, it's not guaranteed they won't act like a clown, but they more than likely won't. It's kind of groupthink. Four or five people acting silly running around in random bits of gear, everybody else is going to do that. Four or five people in the room, serious, not serious, you know what I mean, like in their proper role with a proper kit, that's going to influence everybody else to act like that. But I had fun. It was interesting to zip around. I got to kill some down Russian pilots. I got to use the AA. It was all sorts of a good, fun time. Is there anybody that has to go immediately that wants to say before we start going normal down the line? Um, I'm going to head out to bed. But Go ahead, Hattie. I'm glad he say words. I had fun. It was good. It was, you know, unwinnable. But yeah, yeah. I had a good time. Peace. Uh, Hatter, do you have to Autobots roll out? I'm I'm actually tired, yes, because I've been up since 1 in the morning. Okay, say uh, your piece. That was a shit show and a half, and I don't even... And Patches, I'm going to say this right now. What's I up? don't even know what the hell you wanted sometimes, because sometimes it would be, I need you back here. Although I was told to be up there, and then I'm back there, I'm getting told to be up there at the front. I don't know what the hell was going on, but I, that just shit just fucking just drove me insane tonight. Uh, there's nothing we could do about that. If the situation's ever evolving, then you're going to get dragged around. Because I can't... If the Russians are at place A, and then they're at place B, that's just going to happen. There's nothing I can do about that. I can't not just send you somewhere you're needed just because it's inconvenient and constantly happening. If you're immediately needed at the front and then you're immediately needed at the back, that's just kind of how that happens. I can't control that. Because if I'm just like, oh, I don't want to bother guys moving them around because they might get mad, then we're going to get flanked. Like, that's kind of silly not to worry about a threat just because you guys might get annoyed that you're being moving around so much. Because if there's Russians in the back line, Hatter, there's Russians in the back line and we need to deal with it. <laughs> so I get what you're saying. I get that it's frustrating, but sometimes it just kind of happens. I'm sorry. Yeah, well, yeah, whatever. Anyways, um, Covert. All right, I'm going to wrap it up here. Uh, TMT, I'm sorry, like, you know, 22 minutes ago, so I'm just going to skip it tonight. But regardless, thank you so much for watching. Go operate operationally. We'll be back tomorrow for some Daisy in the morning, Friday night fights, Daisy in between, and more Friday night fights, the more Daisy. <laughs> a lot of stuff there. And otherwise, cheers, guys, and have a good one.